happy with our forward. I thought our forwards defensively played great. I thought they looked for each other great, especially uh, Daniel and, and Javon. I thought they did a great job of finding each other in their offense. Yeah, they getting a better feel. You know, Mo had a big game too. I guess. Yeah. Six blocks. Your big guys get just kind of getting a better feel for each other. That's you know, you, I've said this a number of times after games with this team. We just need to play games together, get a feel for each other. Obviously, Daniel and Javon have never played together. And Daniel and Mo, and uh, Mo's getting a lot of playing time now. Mo, I thought Mo started the game off great and, uh, with a lot of energy. And I just think, you know, we've been so guard oriented that, you know, people naturally come in and try to take our guards away. I, I just think it's, it's, it's really uh, exciting that our forwards are, are finding each other and playing well off of each other. Jay, what did you see in Der Deron Hilliard today? He made a real good effort today on the basket. What did you see in him? He really did. He, and I'll tell you what I saw is that he defended well today. He really played. Um, he had a great defensive game. He stripped a point guard at, at half court. Uh, Darren's an aggressive offensive player, confident offensive player. We always want him to continue to grow defensively. I thought he did an outstanding job. Jay, coming into this game, you came off an emotional game against St. Joe's. You had exactly. Yeah, we, we had a lot of time to talk to the guys after the game because we knew Delaware was going to go first and we had to wait for, for this. So uh, we talked a lot about that. That uh, you know, again, learning experiences, coming off the St. Joe game, being in finals. Uh, these guys had finals yesterday. They have finals tomorrow. Uh, our practice schedule is way off. Uh, just a lot of maturity. I'm very, very pleased with that. Were you pleased the way Al Jarvis three played for Delaware today? Just shot the ball. What was your impression on him today? He's tough, man. He, you know, we, we knew we didn't know if he was going to play or not because he's been hurt, and uh, uh, kind of hoping he wouldn't. I hope he was healthy, but wouldn't. But he's tough, man. He's the kind of guy who would do a good job defensively at the end of the shot clock. He can get you in the lane and just make shots, tough shots. I thought in the first half he made some tough shots. That we were playing pretty good defense. Talk about the performance by your defense with nine blocks today. That's what, a part of our, what I'm saying about our forwards. Um, our forwards can block shots, but you have to learn how to do it within our defensive concepts uh, because they also have to get out far out on the perimeter to defend ball screens. And these guys are starting to get out on the perimeter and defend ball screens and get back inside and block shots. Obviously, Mo Sutton, being a senior, very good at it, but uh, Daniel had two today. Uh, Javon had one, so uh, that's something we can, this team can be good at. Javon, are the big guys getting a little more comfortable with one another and kind of knowing where each other likes to be on the court? Um, yes, we just being up with each other. And, um, we always working together in practice, getting a feel for um, just staying together, working together, uh, coming to meet the pass, things like that. It's just the little things with us. Just keep getting better every, each and every day. Dave, do you feel comfortable, uh, you know, since you've been out, I've known you, of course, since you were a sophomore at West Town. Uh, over the last couple of weeks, it seems like you're getting a lot more uh, playing time. Are, are you are you comfortable in the system you're in right now? Definitely. I think it's been a practice since moving to Jay and uh, Mo. I've been practice. I'm very experienced guys. They're going to push me every day. So I keep up with them. I keep up with the country. Do a good job of practice. Does their development also take some of the guards, take some of the pressure, and, and allow them to grow as well? Definitely, Terry. That's, that's something that you know we've been talking about. Is that when I say to you guys, this team has to learn how to play together. That that's part of it. That we have young guards. So people are going to go after our young guards. So if they're going to go after them, the forwards are going to have to make plays. You know, there's a lot of times we started the offense today through Javon or or Daniel at the top of the key. Those guys are they're getting good at that. And it really does. And I think our three-point shooting shows that, that uh, they've got to help a little bit more in our forwards, and, uh, and then they're getting some open looks. Jay, do you think today's game had a carryover from the last game against St. Joe's that you make you guys more comfortable with uh, Yes, we, we just wanted to go out there and play ball and over basketball. Uh, and that's what we did. We played tough on defense, got stops, and got out in transition. That's what we wanted to do. Always, always be on attack and coach always to be on attack. So that's what we want to do. Jay, 
Jay has seven, seven boards for Ashley Kubu and something he's been rebounding the ball really well lately. Can you talk about I mean, his effort in general off the bench, but especially uh, on the boards? He, he brings so much energy. He, he's a guy that's, that's still, still kind of learning our system. Um, our system is actually the complete opposite of his system in high school. I, I mean, the more I watch him learn, the more I understand how it was, it's everything we do is the exact opposite of what he did. I mean, he was like a coach's dream in high school. So he did everything the way they wanted him to. And it was a good way for him in high school. So it was why we started at the beginning of the second half, because he just brings so much energy. He's, uh, he's so tough defensively. He goes to the offensive glass. just makes so many things happen out there. I'm really proud of his progress. He's, 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 he's going to keep getting better as he gets comfortable in our system. Talk about the performance by James Bell. You know what? He's, he's just becoming our rock, man. We, we just count on him. End of games, need a big play. He guarded Sadler a lot. Um, in, in terms of leadership with our team, he's a great team leader. He's, he's, uh, he's, doing, every, he's doing everything right now. He's hitting threes, defending, rebounding, and, and, and leading our team. Hey, Jay, at halftime, did you just kind of feel like, you know, in the second half, it was just a matter of making shots? I mean, is that, you know, is that really all you guys had to start doing better? Because you were dominating the boards already in the first half. Yeah, you know what? I was more concerned at halftime with, with our energy. I felt like at the, sometimes we were, uh, you know, I didn't think we started the game with great energy. You know, I thought most Sutton made some great defensive plays and kept us alive early. But I thought they came into the game a little bit more energized, you know, and, I'm glad I can talk about this after, but whether it's finals or whatever, you know, that shouldn't affect you, a good team. Um, so we started the second half. We were talking more about our energy level. That's why we started the group we did in the second half, and, and I thought it. I thought that those guys did a great job of, of getting us going. And, and, you know, that's when you start making shots. You, uh, start of the second half, Ash gets a steal. We kick it ahead. We get an easy basket to start the half. That helps. Talk about your performance on uh, Devin Sadler. Your defense made a real good stop on him. Team effort. You know, our forwards, we, we were soft blitzing him on ball screens. And, you know, he's so good. We said when he comes off ball screens, let's, let's either hard blitz him or, or soft blitz him. And, uh, again, it was these guys. You know, the, the, the guards did a good job on him. Darren, guard, uh, Darren guarded him. Jay, um, Taj guarded him. And uh, these forwards did the job on him. Uh, and, and, you know, you get 19 points, and that's how good he is. This, this kid's a great scorer. Anything else? Thank you, guys.